G'day, g'day, I'm Havoc, and today I got to play the PC beta, but I was frustrated to find that uh, the the graphic settings were a bit limited. Like, there is quite a lot of things you can change, but there's also quite a lot of things that are missing that you would expect to find in a PC game, especially, uh, you know, a AAA. But it is in beta. I'm sure they're going to add uh, more settings later down the road, but we could be waiting a while. So, because of that, uh, we're going to have to do some editing via uh, any files. Uh, so I'm going to quickly show you how you can do that and where to find them. So let me go to my display capture here. Let's minimize OBS and we're going to have to go to the directory. So first up you've got the game directory uh, which is here. I've got it on my solid state drive and then we've got the documents folder. So your you know main drive, your users, then your username, documents, my games folder 76. Now this here I think is the main uh, place you're going to want to go to edit stuff. Now there are some things that I think you'll want to edit over here in this one. Uh, these are all the different preset files. Uh, there was, was there something else here? No, I don't think so. So I'm not sure. I think there was something for the field of view in here. But I could be misremembering which one it was in. So maybe it was over here. Is that something that most... Where the hell? <laughs> okay, so it is in here. Alright, so... So yeah, like for example, I might go something like 90, uh, well, let's see, default world field, maybe like 110, but I might also just go 90, 90. I'm not sure what default world is that like from the, f I don't know. <laughs> I don't want 190, whoops. So, you know, you're going to want to tweak, you know, field of view, that's something that you're going to want to tweak. Um, personally, I like to turn now, what file was that in? So this is the Fallout 76 one. I think a lot of the settings are going to be in this one. Um, but yeah, fill the fuse in here, so I'm just going to leave that for now, but this, again, this is where you need to go. I don't know, actually, no, I, I didn't really get to test because the server went down, but, uh, so I don't know if you actually need to edit anything over in your actual game directory, because I think it's using these files here. So let's look at those. In here, you're going to have, um, what was it called? Ah, crap, I've forgotten now. <laughs> but yeah, you've got, so, screen space M in occlusion. Turn that off to, you know, it's, that's just going to add more depth to your shadows and all that sort of stuff. So you can turn that off to game performance. Um, obviously, you can edit shadows more. Uh, your anastropic filtering. You can go from 16. I've went down to 8. Um, obviously, you can set full screen or borderless and all that sort of stuff. Some of this stuff you can obviously do within the game. Uh, this is one of the first things I changed. Um, setting anti-aliasing to... Uh, well, I'm not actually sure if that's going to work at 0. I might need to... I can't remember if I got that to work yet. I didn't really get the test. Um, but yeah, that was one thing I noticed. The game by default for me was it seemed to be like eight times and it was my performance was real bad. <laughs> um, so anti-aliasing, definitely you know a really good performance gain by turning that either off or lower. Um, there's uh, so depth of field is one I turned off straight away which is here under image space, and then you've got motion blur. I definitely want to turn that off. Same with lens flare. Uh, I might mess, I might try this on and off. Um, reflections, I might leave those on, but another one might be worth turning off to gain more performance. Um, V-Sync, if I can remember what that was, where would that be under? Here we go. I think this is V-Sync here. Um, I did notice when I, because I, when I first loaded the game, I couldn't go over or above uh, pretty much half my monitor's refresh rate, so I was getting locked at 40 hertz, it seemed, so 40 frames per second, um, and turning this to zero fixed that, so I assume that's uh, basically turning VSync off. Um, so that's also something you're going to want to do if you're having that issue. Now, if you've got a beefy computer, you probably won't need to, um, but yeah, if you do want to make sure you're getting as good a frames as possible, turning this off, at least just to try out, is recommended. Um, yeah, so to give you an idea, um, I'm on an i5-8400, a GTX 1066GB, 16GB RAM, and didn't run out great, but yeah, I think it defaulted to Ultra, um, but again, you know, not being able to, like, cust you know, click Custom, for example, I could turn Shadows down, but I couldn't turn this off, I couldn't turn Motion Blur and all that, so I'm, I'm doing it through here, um, I was able to confirmed that this worked but after the servers went down so I could see that the frame rate was then uncapped but I didn't get to see how my frames were then in game 
But uh, yeah, it's, it did seem like it'd be running all right once I tweak all this stuff. So I'll be doing that. So uh, once the servers are back up again, I think for Thursday, um, I'll be I'll be definitely streaming. So you can catch me at twitch.tv slash Hextavic. I'll be streaming on there. I'm, I'm an Aussie. I recently got actually good internet, which I've been waiting for for five years. So I'm starting to stream again pretty much daily. And Fallout 76 something I've been looking forward to. Um, so yeah, I'm going to be testing all this sort of stuff. I, I'll probably, you know, for the first, uh, you know, <laughs> good, good amount of time, maybe an hour, maybe not that much, but as I'm playing, uh, at the beginning, I'm going to definitely tweak and test out this and find the best possible settings, especially for my type of setup, which, you know, is a mid-range PC. So yeah, I'll be doing a lot of tweaks then. Anyway, I've gone already uh, on, on and on and on, <laughs> so I'll just shut up for now, um, yeah, so you find that in, this is your, your main location when you want to tweak all this sort of stuff. And that'll be in your documents, my games, Fallout 76. So anyway, I hope that's helpful. Feel free to come and stop by the stream sometime um, and catch me live. Uh, anyway, again, I hope it's helpful. Thank you and good night.